everyone it's your girl tipsy m and in today's video i'll be sharing the pros and cons of following fashion trends quick disclaimer everything i'll be sharing is based on my own opinion and research without further ado let us get into the video but first make sure that you like comment subscribe and don't forget to follow me on all the socials i leave all the details in the description following fashion trends can give you a challenge um for example let's say you're a person who's into a more subtle look you don't really like bold colors you don't really like bold jewelry or, or any graphics and let's say those bold colors and graphics are trending and um, we can give you a challenge as to how can you incorporate that into your own personal so style. it can make you more confident so fashion is a big part of our society and a lot of people don't know their personal style and they don't know how to dress for themselves so following fashion trends can give you a boost to your confidence because you'll actually feel like you're a part of them. number three you may get a sense of identity by following fashion trends so let's say you're a person who doesn't know their personal style and or you're just trying to figure out what actually you like so following fashion trends can help you with finding your true identity and your true personal style because you're in one minute for example now since a lot of denim is trending you'll try denim and then maybe you realize that no man denim is really not for me and then you can move on to the next trend and try that out and as time goes on you will eventually find um your identity and you can make style. shopping very easy because i mean you're gonna you, there's no need for you to think a lot when you, when you want to go shopping because you will just buy everything that is on trend like it will it will be easier let's get into the disadvantages of following fashion trends so number one is first following fashion trends can be very much costly as much as it can it can make shopping quite easier it can be very 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 costly so the times we live in like fashion is changing fashion you never know what's trending with the world of social media today this might be trending tomorrow that will be trending it can be costly especially if you're a person who does not have a big budget if you do have a big budget and you don't mind spending a lot of money definitely go for it but if you're someone who has a small budget don't don't spend a lot of money on fashion trends it is bad for our environment so like you're spending a lot of money uh always buying clothes always like i said the world that we live in like today something may be trending tomorrow it might not so you're gonna always be buying all these clothes and then in a few months these things will no longer be um trending and because they're no longer which the, because they're no longer trending you don't want to be seen wearing those it end up filling up your closet and what must happen to those clothes in your closet some people would opt to throw them away but i would highly suggest that you guys give them away to a charity or just anybody you know who would really appreciate them or you can actually take them and kind of upcycle them and just play around with them and create something really beautiful out of them lose your own character by following fashion trends so not a lot of people know their own personal style and so many people just want to be a part of something so following fashion trends it's it's really not good because you might lose your own character your own values because you just want to be a part of something uh, but then if you're a strong character and you're really strong in who you are and yeah then you wouldn't really be shaken by a watch trending too you won't have that pressure to actually go and buy whatever is trending whereas if you're not too sure about yourself and you just kind of like go with the flow you're gonna lose who you are the follow of fashion trends are not for everyone just because the certain item is trending does not mean that it will look good on you always keep in by keep in mind your body type your structure um your your skin tone and personality just because something looks good on this person does not mean it will look good on you just because something looks good on me does not mean it will look good, good on you for today's video what i would lastly like to say is that in my opinion um fashion is very subjective um people should feel free to do whatever they want when it comes to fashion and also for me fashion trends are there for affordability and availability what i mean is that 
for example right now a lot of denim is trending you've got the denim jackets denim pants you've got the skinny jeans the white legs you've got the different washes and let's say you're a person who's always been into a denim a few years ago it was kind of hard to get all these items but because it's now trending it is easier it's, it's easily accessible and it's also affordable unlike it was then because then you have to like go on a really manhunt to get those items and when you do they probably a lot of money they probably really expensive but since it's trending you get them at an affordable price and it's easily accessible and you also have different options however when you do that always keep in mind keep in mind your personal style and choose items that will last you for as long as you live okay but that's, that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time